I'll call upon our first speaker, and by the way, the duration of the talk is four minutes, and the discussion is one minute. But if the speakers initially, we, we may take the discussion to two minutes because some of the speakers are not there. So uh, I invite Dr. Arvind Kumar Maurya, who is going to be talking on terminal chop, a recent a novel technique everyone. in hard cataracts. In this film, we aim to demonstrate. Play from start. Greetings, everyone. In this film, we aim to demonstrate Research. our new innovative surgical technique. Greetings, everyone. In this film, we aim to demonstrate our new innovative surgical technique using advanced terminator chopper for chopping of mature heart cataract. We have no financial interest. The rock heart cataracts are always difficult to crack as being stronger in compression but weaker in tensile strength. It is always difficult to crack them with present chopping techniques and instruments with chances of many well-known complications. But according to mechanical rock excavation system and perfect theory of the fracture, it is always difficult to crush in size, skull and segment in these hard rocks with compressive forces. But much easier to break and crack inside out dispersive mechanical forces. Breaking and cracking is much easier when mechanical forces are applied at the open edge on maximal weak points in form of micro notch or micro grooves at the surface of any hard material. So, there are many specialized best tools available which are pushed in the natural or the thread grooves with the help of blunt hammer like objects leads to crack these hard rocks under tension and complete split is achieved in no time. Terminal chop is a new surgical technique developed by Dr. Rajendra Prasad works on the principle of secondary rock breakage system with concentrated dispersive forces to crack these unbreakable hard nuclei. In this technique, similar to cracking and breaking these solid hard rocks, a unique inside out dispersive mechanical forces are created to initiate a full thickness crack at the weakest soft thin equator which simply traverses into the entire nucleus breaking it into two complete pieces. Mechanics of terminal chop initiate a tensile fracture in a more direct manner from the equator parallel to the nuclear surface in a very efficient, least manipulative and minimal use of FACO forces. Unlike in the vertical and horizontal chopping, utilizing high compressive forces with high stress in these type of hard nuclei. So, there is a specially designed advanced terminator chopper developed by Dr. Rajendra Prasad with blunt olive tip to safely hook, hold and stabilize and then initiate crack at the equator of the nuclei. The mode of action of terminator chopper is similar to drag tool generating stress at the site of initial groove. In the direction of the equator, on the other side, parallel to the nuclear surface to create a tensile fracture and divides hard nuclei into two complete segments. In this new innovative surgical technique, both the FACO probe and the advanced terminator chopper are always parallel to the iris screen as compared to the other chopping techniques like the vertical and the horizontal chop. Thank you, thank you so very much. So it's a nice uh, technique, we are seeing it for the last two, three years. So, uh, in case of a small people, yesterday we saw a <coughs> chopper, so which was working very well in a small people. So many a times we uh, encounter small people. 
So does it uh, work in the small people with heart cataract? Yeah, then uh, we need to use the people uh, expanders. Then we can use it. Uh, so if we use viscoelastic, just viscoelastic for uh, stretching the pupil? It will yeah, if work. viscometriasis work, uh, the cohesive, sometimes it works very well. Yes, of course we can go for that. But if the dilatation is still not good, we need to opt for the pupil Because expander. you have to go to the equator. Yeah, we have to go to it. That's why, so we need to use the pupil expanders. BX is very, uh, means that can be easily uh, implanted and it gives a very good dilatation. Okay. Uh, 